Everyman Driver Nation, Zoom Zoom, just arrived. 2018 Mazda CX-9 all-wheel drive. This is the Grand Touring trim level and the color is Soul Red Metallic. Isn't that beautiful? Not a gorgeous day here too. Oh my goodness, this is kind of a lucky day. So they just washed it, dropped it off. I have not opened the car. It's in the same spot the driver left it. I'm gonna take you on a one take walk around, no editing. Uh, I'll have my uh, full week of experience with it, and then I'll put together a video for you at the end of my week. But since I just got it, let's go ahead and learn a little bit about this. I know it was uh, redesigned in 2016, no new changes on 17, and I don't know exactly what's new on it this year, so it'll be fun learning this year. 20 inch rims on it here. This does have a 2.5 liter inline four cylinder turbo engine, 232 horsepower, I believe, 310 pound feet of torque. Gosh, just love the sun on the red. I love red, period. So let's open this thing up. I got my key fob here. Oh, when I did this, the turn signal indicators on the side mirrors lit up. What do we got here? Let's go ahead and open this too because I gotta put my bag back here. Three row crossover SUV. Let's see what's got back here. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Three rows. The last row oh my where's the leg room i don't see any leg room before we even go to the front i know that the numbers back here this has like 14 cubic feet of volume behind the back seat here fold that down i think it's 38 or 41 from previous memory and then in the upper 70s when those two rows are folded down of course i'll give you a cargo room demo uh, later this week. Maybe I'll do some experimenting with putting stuff back there on my errands. Yeah, 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 sky active technology. Okay, so that's back there. What else we got here? Ooh, that's nice. Climate controls for the middle row passengers. Seven row, seven passenger SUV. In some cases, like the last vehicle I had, it had bucket seats, not bucket seats, but uh, captain seats in the back. And that was a Hyundai Santa Fe. And that was the 2018. So this one actually has more seating capacity than the one I just had. Let's go push button start. It's got a six speed automatic transmission, sport mode here. Ah, I love that smell. So, okay. There's your instrument cluster three dials it says 65 degrees it feels warmer than that so a full tank of gas gives you 530 miles of range damn steering wheel mounted controls standard usual suspects as you would find dual climate control heated seats heated steering wheel do they have ventilated the seats that's what i want right now and it looks like a negatory so I'm going to put the AC on, turn this down. Got a seven inch, no, eight inch screen up here. What's up with my fan? Eight inch screen, and the dial here will adjust what I'm working with up there. So applications, it should have some fuel on here. Yep, fuel economy monitor. Of course, I have nothing right now. Rated at 20 city, 26 highway. Mixed driving number of 23. So the driver who brought it over here was averaging 22. He drove over here from Seattle. So let's go back to a different option. Entertainment gives me radio. We've got satellite radio on this one. Communication, hook up your phone, which I will do. Navigation, settings, what's settings? Refresh my memory. Oh, that's right. There is a heads up display. Let's see if you can see it here, yep. There it is, heads up display. So it doesn't protrude, no plastic cap there, just uh, right there on the window. That's nice. Sport mode, let's go put it in reverse. See how that, what does right there, okay. So a straight up backup camera, which, do these turn? Nope. So the lane lines don't turn. I wish that was the case, it wasn't. All right, back to park cup holders there. USB is probably in here. 
There it is, two of them. Nice uh, leather trim seats. Looks like they're perforated. Is that the right word? Lane departure warning there. That was a trunk, trunk release. Okay, okay, okay. Let's do a backseat leg room and headroom quick demo. Oh, a sunshade. I like that. Cool. So I think that was about my driving position. So here you go for leg room. If not, it's really impressive. I didn't feel cramped in the front seat. So I'm 5'11". That's what my leg room looks like. Again, there's the climate controls. Sunroof, sliding sunroof here, just one. And then headroom. Yep, there's an indent. I love these. You can see that real well in the camera, indent. So I'm 5'11". So I'm comfortable. So that much room. Fold down armrest, pair of cup holders here. This looks like a 60-40 split for the back seat. This is, this is, this is luxurious back here. It feels like a a high-end vehicle just by sitting back here, partly because it's uh, the highest trim level they have. Four O blank handles. What's an O blank handle? You hang on to one of these things when you're saying, oh, sh you know what, when you're going off-road possibly, which you can in this one. I think the ground clearance is probably in the sevens. This is, and I've taken these off-road before. Well, those, those, those rims are cool. MSRP on this is uh, 42 and change. If you have any specific suggestions on what you want to see in terms of our view, leave it in the comment section below ASAP because I got the car today. I'll have it for the next seven days, do my video on the seventh day, then I'll rest, and then I'll post it on YouTube. And if you have any cool suggestions, I'll do a shout out to you and say, hey, this came from so-and-so. They wanted to see this. How about that? Okay. Hey, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching this little quick walk around. Just arrived, 2018 Mazda CX-9 all-wheel drive. I'm Dave. Thanks for watching. See you later. Adios. How do you know you're getting the best deal on a new or used car? Call 844-765-0610. Make one phone call to hear about all the great deals near you. We know all the brands and all the best deals. We're not a dealer. We're here to help you find the right car. Call 844-765-0610 today.